First impressions of Abercrombie and Fitch. First instinct, extreme. A lot of my subscribers have been telling me to get this one. $35 on eBay for the big bottle. What a steal. This isn't a detailed analysis. This isn't my concrete opinion that will come in the future. I will be reviewing this full bottle and doing a five mil decant giveaway sometime in the future. So look out for that. I have the dry down on both my hands after and it's been about four hours. I don't know if you guys have smelled fragrances that are similar back to back, but whichever hand I smell first will smell stronger. And then for some reason, when you smell the other one, it will smell weaker. I'm having that problem with this one. So I'm really trying to, I smell this one first okay now wait i smell this one first so trying to figure it out very very similar but the, the first instinct extreme definitely has done a few different things for me first instinct is a little bit more airy um, this one has the same kind of smell but it's a little bit more thick a little bit less airy i do get more of a fruity note in the beginning this one has that melon which makes it unique this one i get the melon but i also get kind of like a little bit of this fruitiness first instinct the original it doesn't have any leather so i do get a little bit of leather in the middle of it and it's almost like a smoky leather when you keep digging your nose in there it keeps jumping back back to that original DNA. Off the first impression, I do like First Instinct Extreme more. The problem with First Instinct is it's extremely, extremely youthful. Abercrombie & Fitch is an extremely youthful brand, but this one, it's got a little bit more thickness to it. I would say it's just about as sweet, but it does a little bit more things when you get a little bit of this sophisticated leather in there, just a little bit. Like I, I'll get a whiff of it. And like I said, when I keep smelling it, it'll just start smelling like First Instinct again, which I really, really like. So that's been my first impression. To me, I like First Instinct Extreme more for now be looking for my video in the future when i give this one a full review if you have any more questions about this down below i could answer in the comments like again i will be doing doing more testing i could probably answer any question that you have for me right now again really quick more fruity in the opening more of a full feel and then it has a slight um smoky leather vibe that peaks in and out and this one i believe had suede in it so maybe it's like switching out the suede for the smoky leather vibe kind of giving it more of like a a slight object kind of feel because suede is an object leather is an object and it's kind of nice to incorporate those into colognes okay, i really really like it let me know what you think of the video like comment subscribe that'd be so so great and i'll see you all in the next video i'm having a great day out here hopefully having a great Like unique bottle, unique design.